G'day guys, uh, just doing a quick video of um, the oatmeal stout that I made a couple of weeks ago. It's finally in a, a glass. <clears throat> it's, it is still a bit cold. You can probably hear the bombers in the background, they're, they've just started. Hopefully they'll win. Um, it's becoming a lot more roasty and uh, oatmeal, <clears throat> as you'd expect from an oatmeal stout. Just let that warm up for a bit. But uh, my mum has a uh, like birthday present sort of thing. She got me this printed, which I thought was pretty good. Although, I don't know why that's mirrored. But it's not mirrored in real life anyway. That's going to go on my uh, Kiza, which I'm going to build hopefully in the next couple of weeks. Uh, hopefully this weekend, actually. And um, there's the bottle of wine from the dinner. Lovely drop. Let me drop. All right, let's get into it. Mm. <clears throat> it's actually maturing quite well. In a couple of weeks, I think that's going to be a real winner. Um, if you recall from the previous video, or my first video, um, the original gravity was missed by about 10 points. So, um, yeah, I wasn't expecting great things from this beer, but it's still a drinkable beer. It's still got a nice amount of bitterness. Um, there is a tiny bit of lacing happening around the top of the glass. But it is, it is still quite cool, so it's, um, you know, probably going to improve as it warms up. But, um, no, very happy with that. And uh, I might be doing a video about my keys of build, I'm not too sure yet. But uh, if, if anything, I, I might just uh, add some still photos and, um, you know, just do like a step-by-step, -step, but maybe not a video as such, but a video of still photos. If that makes any sense. Uh, anyway, this one was just a quick update about the, the oatmeal stout. And um, yeah, I'm going to go enjoy the bombers. Enjoy, cheers, and we'll talk soon. Thanks.